Hi, and welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Anna. Welcome back, dreamers. If this is your first time visiting, thank you for popping in. I know you didn't have to stop in, so hope you enjoy your stay. And if you do, subscribe, become a part of the family, hit the all notification um, button so you don't miss out on any future uploads. Now, just to give you a heads up, I do have my Juvia's Place a Mystery um, Black Friday deal. So I have it here. It just came in. I also have three little Alta boxes. So that's going to be a separate video with some Alta goodies. I do also have my Dollhouse Miniature Magazine that just came in. I might do a video on this and do a walkthrough for this if you guys are into Dollhouse Miniatures, 112 skill like I am. And I also... <laughs> I need to do like an evenings with Anders. I can do my advent calendars and stuff. Um, I know I missed yesterday. I just, girl, I was not feeling right. Mm -mm, I've been under the weather for like the past two days, but I'm much better now. I am. Now I did a video, a complete video showing you how to do this. I did the diamond painting kit with the Taiga Rar. Okay. And I was able to finish it that same evening. And I just wanted to show it to you. It's really pretty. It actually has a lot of glimmer. I know you don't see the glimmer here. Let me see if I could. If I turn off this big light, you might see the glimmer. Let's just see. I'm going to turn off my big light. Ooh. Can you see the glimmer? No. Okay. See the difference with the big light versus no light? <laughs> I know that light makes a big difference. Okay. Well, it's really pretty in person. It does have some shimmer and shine to it that you can't see here. I did a whole video showing you how to do it and how easy it is. Okay. And my very first, my very first Christmas card for this season came from Cindy Lou. Cindy Lou, I just got it. And da, 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 thank you so much, Cindy. I've been so worried about you. Um, Karen and I were both talking about you. We were like, we haven't seen Cindy. I hope she's okay. I know she wasn't doing well. So, you know, I love it when you make your cards. All these are handmade by Cindy. Thank you so much, Cindy Lou. You're my very first Christmas card and you're so stinking sweet. Oh, thank you so much. I love my card. Okay. So now on to the show. Oh, and if you didn't already see it, I know I have to give myself some shameless plugs here. I did a dot house. Ba -ba -da -da. Look what I do with my kitchen. A before, completely empty room, and after, and some other things. So, okay, there you go. Now we'll get into it. Uh, the first thing I want to share with you are, I always like to say the foodie finds. But before that, they had a really beautiful new painting. Well, it's their wall art. It's not an actual painting per se. But it's the one that's a little bit on the oblong side. It's like a little longer. And I thought it was, let me just take it out of the plastic because I know you're getting a glare, girl. I know you are. I'm gonna put that in the trash. There you go. So now you can see how beautiful it is. Isn't that pretty? I love it. So this is um, my newest piece here. Yes. And somebody asked me about my nails. This is Paparazzi from CVS, um, my nail polish. I don't know what the name of it is, though. I have to touch it up. Yeah. I, I went back from green, a hunter green, back to I did the this color on top to, to get the little shiny mermaid blue. I just did it yesterday. All right. So I got their really pretty picture. Yay. They have a lot of new little pictures, you know, that are available. Then they had some new foodie finds. Ba -ba -da -da. So they have the fiddle faddle. Okay. They have it in butter toffee and in caramel. So they have them both. And I believe if I'm not mistaken, these are six ounces. Best by date. Wow. That's kind of hard to read in these darker boxes. June of 2024. So this is a good one to have, especially if you have a company, set it out in a couple of bowls. It'll be gone within a matter of minutes. Fiddle faddle, again, caramel and butter toffee, full size. Let me put that in there. It's got to go down. Stay off. The next one, <laughs> crunch and munch. So they have the fiddle faddle and they have the full size. So I have them in the right way. Yeah, I do. Okay. They have the full size. Crunch and Munch in caramel with peanuts 
and buttery toffee with peanuts. So both of these have peanuts and they're both six ounces each. And their best buy date is May of 2024. So another two full sizes of munchies that you could just put in a bowl whenever you need it. And there you have it. Super excited to see that they brought in the Paducah products. I love the Paducah cookies. I like the little cakes. And I got this time around, I got the chocolate chip mini panettone. Is that how you say it, you guys? They did have the vanilla as well. But I thought this would be a nice little treat for the boys since it's a 2.8 ounce. It's been rather cold. So this one will be a good one with some what? Hot cocoa. Make some hot cocoa. You know, with some milk. Mm, girl. Cut that up. Perfection. Okay. So there you go. This is also great as a gift. Okay. $1.25. Everything I'm sharing with you is $1.25. Now, the main reason, I'm not going to sit here and fake the funk. The main reason why I went in there is because I saw some y'all hauling these coffees. And I was like, come on, when is my store going to bring them? Harry and David, right? They brought it. So I have the a milk chocolate and peanut butter coffee. And they are a four ounce. And you guys, you can't beat this price. For four ounces, $1.25. Two of them. 250 you you can't get an eight ounce bag of coffee for two dollars and fifty cents anywhere this and let alone it be harry and david so i did get three of the milk chocolate peanut butter they did also have you know the standard creme brulee that they normally have and then the bourbon vanilla they still had that but i wanted the new ones this one is butterscotch caramel again four ounce butterscotch caramel butterscotch caramel right there let me show you got three of those that was the milk chocolate milk chocolate peanut butter and then i got the maple vanilla honey yes i did maple vanilla right there four ounces got three of those so this is going to be nice. And then whenever these brew up, they're very aromatic. So it's like you get the two punch, you know, it tastes good and it smells good. Love that. All right. And if you're into coffee, go check out my trash talk video. My last two trash talk videos. I have a ton of different flavored coffees from different brands that I give reviews on. Go check it out. Okay. The next a foodie item that I have here, um, this is new. Let me not get it so close. There we go. So this is called Dunkin' Chocolates. Okay, and it says donut flavored filled chocolate jelly donut. You get two. It's by Frankfurt. White chocolate shell with layers of raspberry flavored cream and jelly filling. So there should be like two in here. So this would be a nice little gift with a card for somebody. Yeah. So that just looks delicious. So I did just get one. Um, the best idea for this is September of 2024. So I'm going to be trying that one out. Then as you guys know, I shared the coppers with you before. But in the pink bag, they have a different one now. And I highly recommend that one. This is totally an adult indulgence. It's not for kids. This is an adult indulgence. Um, item. So this is the espresso beans and dark chocolate. Okay. The pink one is delicious. So I know this one's going to be good too. They didn't even have any more of the pink ones. So I only got one, you know, just, you know, like I said, it's an adult thing that we will enjoy, you know? So there you go. Coppers. Got to try it. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. I mean, I'm pretty much guaranteed it's going to be delicious. Okay. Then the next like new thing they had, name brand, Vagicel Sensitive Scents Lavender Wildflower Dry Wash. Okay, I got two. And it looks like this, and it says 30% more. And it says clean and refresh feeling without water for instant refreshing on the go. Skin-friendly scent, hypoallergenic, no parabens or MIT preservatives. 
um, gynecologist tested. So they have this right now available. There you go, name brand. Let me put that right there. And I also picked up some of Lavoris. They brought back the Lavoris. Now this one has a, it's clear. When you use it, you see it's clear. It's mainly peroxide. It's like a peroxide based mouthwash. And I really like that. So um, this is also good because it has so much peroxide in it. If you're trying to clean your toothbrushes, so you leave them in a little cup, you pour some of this in there. You know, if you don't have Listerine or something, you pour it in there and you know, that'll take care of it. They brought that back. Really happy to have seen that. Then in the picture aisle, they had these really cute, um, what do they call them? Chalkboard, chalkboard uh, little picture frames. And they have two variations. And they can't stand up on a table or you can hang them up. Um, I'm not too sure how. I know what I want to do with them. Because I want to use them like as for background to say, please subscribe or something on there or say only in my dreams and one of them and have them like right behind me uh, or on a wall because I'm I'm redoing this whole craft room. That's why everything looks like a hot mess in here. I, I've been working diligently little by little every day. So there you go. You see my light. <laughs> you see the light. Oh, there we go. You see my light. Yeah. So there you go. They have these super cute. Very nice to have. And I'm looking forward to trying to incorporate them into my little, you know, you know. Now they have the A&W on the go drink mixes. My kiddos like these. They requested it. So I got it. My twins. For the waters. They like the way that tastes, the root beer. Then um, for cosmetics, I only got two things. And they're both the same thing. It's the beauty intuition, right? Yeah, love your lips, hydrating, nourishing lip gloss. This is that really weird color that I love. I have it on right now. I do. It it just it's, it's working out for me personally over like really dark lipsticks when I just want to lighten them up a little bit. So I got two of them because I hadn't seen them. They just brought it back and I was like, you know what? <laughs> I need to get two. And I love the packaging. Look at that. Look at that packaging. It's everything. But it's that really weird color. But it works so well trying to tone down those really those really dark ones. I gotta put it right, right behind me. If I don't, I'm gonna be upset with myself. There we go. It's gonna run into my makeup bag right here. I got a makeup. I got two makeup containers. And that's part of the stuff I wanna um, organize and move around. I'm just putting it right there. Okay. Yeah. Then I did get the, what's this called by Be Pure Brightening Under Eye Mask. I could have sworn I picked up a different one. Like there's another one and might have slipped out of my, my basket because it was, I only had like three things in it for a long time and it might have like slipped out because it was like real thin like that. But this is for your under eyes. And the other one was for the under eyes as well. So it was something different. I can't remember by who, but it was something different. So that's what it looks like. And it says here, it says help brighten your day with refreshed under eyes with collagen and caffeine. So that's going to be a nice little treatment. Yes, it will be. Yes, it will. Then um, I did find these as I was leaving. I need these for our chips. I did buy a bag of chips for myself. That's for me. Even though they're going to end up eating it. I bought it for me, but they're going to end up eating it. Yeah, I'll probably get one or two out of the whole bag, but it's all good. Um, and then they had these as well, and these really cool pens. So these are these little squishy things. They have these with the gifts. What are these called? Stretchy food secret menu. Um, so I'm going to put this in their stocking stuffers for the twins. And I thought I picked out three, but it looks like I only got two. But I'll probably try to get Frankie something else more age appropriate from like five and below. Unless they come out with something kind of cool at Dollar Tree. Um, so this one is like a burger, right? It has like all the fixings in it and everything. Then this is like a waffle sandwich. See that? And they're squishy. So that is for their stockings, which I have right here underneath my desk. Then they have these really cool pens, you guys. 
Look at these. I know. I know. This one reminds me of what? This one's called Junk Food Pen. This reminds me of what? Friends. Yeah. Remember the big coffee thing? That's what it reminds me of. So if you have a Friends um, person that just loved the show Friends, this would be a nice pick to send to them. Okay. And it's, it's heavy on the top, but if you write, it'll just rest neatly. And it's a larger, rounder style pen versus... Let me show you one of their newer pens that I got. Let me see if I, if the kids didn't take it. I have all my pens right here. I think that, no, okay, no, that's not it. The kids did take it. It's the one that had like the world on it. Yeah, they took it. See, cause I have all my other pens right here. I have all my, all my, you know, pretty pens that I've created. They're all right there, but they took that one. The one with the little world on it. Well, this is thicker, so it's nicer if you have arthritis. It's not on the thin side like the other ones normally are. Then they have the donut, and they have it both on both ends, which is nice. So you have the donut, you have the coffee, you have a burger, then you have a pizza. Okay, so I was thinking I'm going to put these in their stocking stuffers. So they're really cool. Okay, I just got to figure out who's going to get what. And let me see. I'm trying to make sure I shared everything. Did I share everything? I think I did. Okay, so you're going to see me in the same clothes. You are. You're going to see me in the same clothes. I'm going to do my Alta next. I'm going to do my Juvia's Place Cosmetics next. And um, I think that's it for today. Maybe I'll do an Evenings with Anna as well. I still have to do my Dollhouse Men Chart Magazine. I'll share that with you guys. And that's it. So thank you so much for coming by. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.